So there is this little hack that if you add that into your event or your, your challenge funnel, it will be, well, not so little, right? In fact, I'll show you an example where it has actually resulted in over $250,000 in donations, right? And I'm not even exaggerating. So I'll tell you exactly what it is, how to do it, and I'll leave no stone unturned. Sounds fair? Let's do it. So here's how most people actually run their events, right? They have some kind of registration page, right? And then they have a page where they say like, hey, congrats for registering. And then uh, they run the event and on the event they sell stuff, right? That is the simple model. And the problem with this is that, well, you need to promote the heck out of this page, right? You need to run ads, only, which is quite expensive. Uh, SEO would be too slow because there's only a limited time that you actually have to run the event or to get people into the event. So how do you actually promote your event? Well, all of these techniques like ads, all that, they work, affiliates, all great, but there's one missing ingredient that if you're not adding that, you are usually missing out. And that is a, what I call viral loop. And this means that when people actually register to your event, when they enter their name and email address, you then give them an incentive, something of value, something they can actually get if and only if they actually get their friends to also sign up. And the way this works is not to say like, hey, share and you'll get something. I did this the very first time. There was just a big ass blue button, share and they would get something. And what happened is that people just shared randomly, but they didn't actually try to get their friends to sign up. So then I implemented the Dropbox model. What they did is they gave everyone their own unique invite link, which automatically keeps track how many people actually sign up. And then if, and only if their friends actually sign up, I recommend three people at least, if they sign up three people, then they get three people to sign up. They also enter their email address. And these are legit quality emails. Then automatically that person would get a gift, a reward, which ideally is a digital gift. Especially if, for example, you're running an education style event, right? That extra information, secret stuff that is not available anywhere else is what people love getting, right? As a reward for saying thank you. And then not only will you get new people coming in, but then those people also sign up and they get the same incentive. And that is where the actual exponential effect starts happening. And the reason why this is great is because first of all, it's free traffic, who doesn't want free, right? But also it makes all your auto traffic more effective. Let's say you promote your event using paid ads, right? And you get whatever amount of leads. What would happen if like, so let's say you get 1000 leads, now you have 1,333 leads, right? For free. That is literally a 33 increase in your ROAS as well. Not to mention that you'll be able to reach people that otherwise you wouldn't be able to reach. Not everyone is on these paid platforms, right? And now people will actually be sharing that, not just on Facebook, but on WhatsApp, on Messenger, like on the private channels that they have in little communities on Discord, doesn't matter. Wherever they can share a unique invite link, that's where they bring people into you. And on top of that, people who get referred by a friend, by someone else, automatically trust you more compared to like if they were to just see an ad because people don't trust ads as much. Shocking, right? <laughs> so how do you actually do this? Well, first of all, you start before your event goes live, right? You have your registration page, your name and email address, whatever you need for your business, right? And then you have to ask yourself, like for the, all those people that, that would register, what could you give them? Something really valuable for free if they refer their friends. What is the incentive, right? And my rule of thumb, if you're not quite sure what it is, my rule of thumb is like, if they would not pay for it, they're not gonna invite their friends for it as well. So what could you sell to those people for like 20 bucks, 30 bucks, 40 bucks, right? What would they, what they actually want to buy, right? And rather than charging 20 bucks, you're gonna give that them for free if they invite their friends. In terms of the technical part, like for example, giving them their own unique invite link, automatically tracking it, automatically sending them emails to get them to keep on sharing all of that. That's actually really easy using a platform called a viral. I actually built this for my own because I wanted to promote my events in a more effective way, which is taking care of all of that. You can just go to the website, sign up for an account, and then once you're in, create a new campaign using any of our templates, or you can create from scratch if you wanna be creative. And yes, there's even a template specifically for running events. Once you're in, you just add your rewards and you can have multiple as well. So you can get people to keep on sharing. Even if they invited three of their friends, you can then say like, hey, you know, if you had three more, you would get another amazing thing that you can actually get for free. Then you decide on which networks you wanted to actually start spreading your business. And then you decide on which social media networks you want them to start spreading your event. And you can even incentivize people to do other stuff as well. Like for example, subscribing to your podcast, YouTube, or joining a Discord. You can easily create your own event registration page as well as just share a page from within the platform, or you just use your own registration page if that's what you prefer. 
and that's it. You now upgrade it from having a static event registration page where you have to do all the promoting to a registration page where other people get incentivized to do the promotion for you as well. Just like Eve Winter, who used this exact strategy to get over 13,000 leads into her event as well. Another example is Kurt, who was preparing an event for his leading saints organization and decided to give this whole referral mechanism, this whole referral strategy a go as well. And as a result of doing that, he got over 30,000 leads and over $250,000 in donations. You can actually check this case study out in detail and see exactly what he's done, how he's doing it, or if you want to see more, go to upvar.com, case studies, and then select events right here. I'll see a bunch of different examples of people who've been using Upviral to grow their events, to get more people into their events using referral marketing. So let me know down in the comments, what is your favorite way to get people into your events? Plus, if you have any questions whatsoever, let me know in the comments as well. Thanks for watching. All right, cut, we're done here, let's wrap it up. Oh, well, sorry, uh, you're still there. Well, uh, in that case, thanks for watching and make sure to subscribe to my channel where I share marketing tips, tricks, and strategies that will help you grow your business faster. So you can click on the subscribe button right now or check out the next video. Either way, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.